Although many account names are customized to fit each business, there are a few that always remain the same. Two of these are very similar, accounts receivable and accounts payable. Students just starting out in accounting often get these two accounts confused. So today I want to show you the difference between them and how they are used. Accounts receivable and accounts payable are both accounts used to represent when things are purchased with the intent to pay the purchase sometime in the near future. The only difference between the accounts is which side of the transaction you are on. When customers purchase from you and promise to pay in the future, you would use accounts receivable to record that debt. We call it accounts receivable because you will be receiving money from your customer in the future. When you purchase from a vendor and promise to pay in the future, you would use accounts payable to record that purchase. We call it accounts payable because you will be paying money to your vendor in the future. When we use these two accounts in transactions, we often use the phrase on account. For example, if a customer is buying something and paying in the future, we might say that you make a sale on account. When you buy from a vendor and plan to pay in the future, we might say that you purchase supplies on account. So whenever you see the phrase on account, you know that this refers to either accounts payable or accounts receivable. To know which one to use, just ask yourself, are you going to be paying in the future or receiving? One last thing. Both of these accounts involve some future payment. Eventually, the buyer will need to pay off those debts. When they do, we often see the phrase on account again. When we see that you are receiving money from a customer on account, this reduces your accounts receivable from that customer since you are receiving money and their debt to you is going down. When we see that you are paying money on account, we, this reduces your accounts payable with that vendor since you are paying money and your debt to them is going down. This may sound a little confusing at first, but the more you work with these two accounts, the more familiar it will become. For now, just remember these three things. First, when you see the phrase on account, know you are working with either accounts receivable or accounts payable. Second, if you are receiving money or will receive money in the future, then that's accounts receivable. And third, if you are paying money or will pay money in the future, then that's accounts payable. To learn more about payables and receivables and other accounting topics, check out more of my videos on YouTube or visit ToriNorman.com.